What's up, Vape family? What's going on, guys? Hope you had a fun weekend, and uh, welcome back to reality. It's Monday, which everybody cannot stand. Well, welcome to another review, and welcome to another installment of The Liquid King Chronicles. And of course, guys, I am your host, The Liquid King, your mom's favorite vapor, okay? Very excited to basically um, do this review today. I purchased two bottles of this particular e-liquid a couple of days ago. And uh, pretty stoked that it actually got here today. So shook it up, cracked it open, loaded up some cotton into my uh, J-Bo Indestructible. What are you doing? Come here. Come here. Come here. You want to say hi to everybody? Everybody? This is Rocky. Hey, buddy. Rocky's three years old, also a rescue. Go somewhere else. Well, yeah. Um, with no further ado, let's jump right into the review. The liquid that we're going to be reviewing today, okay, hot off the press, is strapped, okay? And this liquid's from J Mac. J Mac is a fantastic person, um, very, very approachable and easy to talk to. Spoke to him not too long ago and had the pleasure to review Whooped. Okay, um, purchased my first bottle and it was love at first vape. Hashtag team buttercream. Um, absolutely love whooped. Uh, let it steep and it tastes fantastic. That buttercream just pops. I'm excited to review this because this is a strawberry version of it. Um, strawberry whoopie pie and buttercream filling. So it's it it smells pretty damn good it's obviously going to need some steeping moving towards august 8th a lot of liquids getting pumped out and they want to get this out to us as quick as possible so it's our responsibility not all but some liquids do need um steeping which is totally normal but this comes in zero three and six milligram nicotine okay 60 mil bottles 120s will be available soon um you can get this e-liquid at the website that i will post in the description you will not be sorry this is some tasty tasty sauce okay i purchased this with my own money um which i which i normally do not much stuff is sent to me for purpose of review i gotta get myself some skin in the game so i don't mind doing it um i'm almost a connoisseur of some sorts i absolutely love 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 the collection i got behind me i've been starting a 120 milliliter collection um my absolute favorite e-liquids i basically purchase them in bulk i'll buy my own bottles and i'll bottle them up but that's not what you came here to hear you came here to hear what my opinion is on e-liquids okay so it gets me very excited when i see in the comment section that someone purchased an e-liquid strictly off of my review and they actually like it which brings some validity to my palate which i feel is pretty decent um again always taste of a certain e-liquid is always subjective what i may love you may hate what i hate you may love so that's the nature of the beast um, but yeah, let's let's dive right into this review. So, to my knowledge, this is going to be sold for anywhere between $22 to $26. I don't know if they've come up with a price point yet. This is not yet released. It has been stocked and shipped out. And um, we'll see how much it is when it comes out. But yeah, it's going to need some steeping. I'm going to tell you that right off the bat. It's going to need at least two to three weeks in a cool, dry, dark place. So, um, I mean, let me see. To my knowledge, this is an 80-20 VGPG. Childproof cap, okay? California Prop 65 warnings on it, and obviously keep out of reach of children and pets, which is good, and it's good that it's childproofed. Again, I've got it loaded up in the Indestructible from Wismec and Jabo. Nice little Addy. I love it. It's simple. It's got a decent sized build deck. It'll hold Clapton coils and um, got it on the RX200S at 55 watts. It's just got a single Clapton in here and we've got some fresh cotton. So let's have us a vape. I'll let you guys know what I think.
vapor production is very prominent with this liquid. And I vape some 8020s that just don't give off plumes. This stuff will plume all day. It's got the whole room filled up. And boy, does it smell yummy. Okay. Cloud production, I would give this a well-rounded four. Um, they linger in the room. They come out nice and thick. And that's what we want. You cloud chasers, that's what you're going to want. Good stuff. Flavor. Believe it or not, the strawberry is actually very prominent in the exhale, which I wasn't expecting. The good part about this one is he's focusing on the strawberry. From what I taste, he's focusing more on the strawberry. Um, and you do get buttercream. It's very, very well blended. As before, you didn't taste much of the whoopee cake itself, and it was all buttercream, which, guess what? I've got no gripe with that. It was so good. It's still good. I still vape it, and it is going to be added to my ADV list. Not a lot of liquids are ADVs for me. They're yummy. They're vaped for a little while, and then they get put in rotation. But ADVs, so far, anything from John Nathan... Um, Soul Custardy is absolutely delicious. ADV. MBYC from uh, Kevin is absolutely delicious. And I've got a few others that we're going to fail to mention at this moment, but it's just tasty stuff. So, flavor is very, very good. Let me have one more. Yeah, that's good. And that's only just going to get better as it steeps. That's good stuff. Um, I would give this a 9.5. It's just up my right up my alley. That's my flavor profile. Um, huge, huge flavor whore. And I love desserty, delicious, decadent, creamy vapes. Um, soul custardy, my balls, your chin. <laughs> uh, whooped, Tallahassee is good. Uh, churned out vapors is very, very good. I'm just a dessert fan, a huge dessert fan. Can only be one, can only be mine, can only be nuts, can only be John Nathan. Doesn't matter. I'll vape it. So, really, really good stuff. Price point is right up there. Again, I always say I love the fact that we now see 60 milliliter bottles. And I think that's the way it should have been the entire time. You're going to hand me bitch about that forever. I don't feel we should have to pay 20 bucks for a 30 milliliter bottle when we're paying $25 for a 60 ml bottle. It just, I understand from a business perspective, if I owned a juice company, um, that's the money maker. That's, that's, that's the money maker. That's where people get their money is people purchase two, three, four, 30 milliliter bottles and they're spending hundreds of dollars. You know what I mean? As opposed to 25 bucks and get double the amount. So that's just my little two cents. Take it for what you will. But um, yeah, definitely a good e-liquid when it is released. I, I urge you guys to go get it. If you're a fan of strawberry, if you're a fan of buttercream, then you're really going to like this. If you're not, you're going to hate it. Plain and simple. Um, J-Mac, I think, has one more liquid that he's going to release. And I'm excited for it. Oh, huge, huge, huge thumbs up. No added sweeteners in this no sucralose okay to the best of his ability he left all the crap out and it's just pure flavor so if you're like me and you're a fh okay you're going to enjoy this stuff you're going to enjoy it and when you crack it open you give it a sniff you taste that really decadent buttercream filling and you get a little touch of strawberry so that concludes this review Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. Obviously, I'm very, very gracious. And um, keep them coming. Like, favorite, subscribe, thumbs up the video. Leave some comments in the comment section. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Okay? No more Red Sox hats. I'm sick of wearing them. <laughs> I don't even remember what I wore last, though. That's pretty much it. Take it easy, guys. And always remember, be kind to one another.